Hello apartment. We are doing early Valentine's Day because we both work on actual Valentine's Day. So we're gonna go ice skating and go see the Lego movie, which we heard was very good. And we're gonna go out to eat somewhere we don't know yet. Hooray! Hi, bitch. Oh, hello. What's up? Nothing. We were sick all week. I had the flu first. And then Matt had it. I still have it, sort of. Well, he had a temperature last night, but now he doesn't. A lot blooded and so fun. Okay. Had a fever of 101. He did have a fever of 101. Yeah. Well, I said it. <sighs> oh, yeah, we're also going to go to a wrestling match. But that's because he's reporting on the wrestling match. My wife insists on it. I've never been to a wrestling match, actually. Should be interesting. Isn't it pretty out here? No. I wasn't asking you. I was asking the internet. Internet, what do you think? Here we are at the ice rink. This should be interesting. <laughs> I'll be there in a moment. Woo! Skate cam. <laughs> go back, go back. <laughs> I'm staying by the wall where I belong. That was intelligent. Look at all the. Matt pointed this out, but look at all the marks from the hockey pucks and the sticks because they actually use this for hockey at yes. the university that's why it's an ice arena oh scoreboard in honor of caleb swedler panther's number one fan ah uh, memorial seats the timeout box all right The sun was in his eyes for that one. Good job. We just ate at the university because I work at the university and we get free food. Yeah! There he goes. He's stealing my car. What a loving husband I have running away from me. Stealing my car, throwing my keys in the air after I got him free food. Bastard. Well, I was joking, but uh, he actually did steal my car. There he goes. <laughs> I can't believe him. <laughs> he thinks this is hilarious. I'm gonna kill him. Oh my god, he's like going up the street. <laughs> oh, there he is. Wow. That's all I gotta say. You better not start moving again. Hi, car. I bet you thought that was hilarious. It was. That is a face of a bitch. 
Look at it, internet. Ew, don't chew your gum like a cow. Fuck a bitch. Okay. Now we're gonna go home, relax a few minutes, and go see the Lego movie! I would like to complain to Plymouth. They took down this McDonald's and moved it. And then just left an empty lot. Just chilling out. Build something! Somebody has to come in and, and make an offer, and then they'll spend out five years deliberating on whether or not it's good to bring that in. Yeah, it took five years for Walmart to be built here. It took five, five years for Lowe's to be approved, at which point they backed out. Yeah, that uh, took so long. It took three years for uh, Fugaki to be built. Fugaki's an Asian restaurant around here. CVS only took one year, though. <sighs> Every time they try to build something new in this town, like the same four families have a hissy fit and say, oh, it's going to ruin the town, and then nothing gets built, and then there's nothing to do here. And we end up having to drive, you know, an hour to Best Buy, or whatever the fuck. Yes. And they don't even have a bowling alley or, or anything like that. Mm -hmm. You gotta travel for everything. And it sucks. Doesn't it? Sucks. Yeah. We're in the movie. The We're gonna see the Lego movie. There's children here screaming, and the mothers are desperately trying to tell them to shut up. Let's see if it happens. <laughs> so we just got done seeing the Lego movie. Warning, spoilers may be present in the next few minutes. What did you think, dear? Face up! <laughs> That was Matthew's favorite part. What was your other favorite parts? All of them. Huh? I liked them all. Oh, okay. It was a good movie. It was badass. Very badass. And the ending was adorable. Yeah. Surprisingly adorable, in my opinion. say except go see it and go buy some Legos <laughs> I want to buy Legos now Matt watches this idiot really see it. Uh, <laughs> Will Ferrell was wizard hippie man no that was Morgan Freeman or excuse me Morgan Freeman Will Ferrell was the business president fellow business. president business I liked Lucy. She was cool. Come with me if you want to know. I liked Emmett before it was cool. <laughs> I liked Emmett before it was cool. <laughs> it's a very quotable movie. Just go see it. It's awesome. The end. Have a nice day. My husband is covering a sporting event and I'm in the audience waiting for him to be finished. I have never been to a wrestling match, so I have absolutely no idea what they're supposed to be doing, or how you win, or anything. I'm actually not even sure which side is Plymouth. Wrestling. <laughs> a 
Apparently we are winning six to three. I figured out um, the people of the Red Stripe is Plymouth, definitely. Okay, so Plymouth is winning. <laughs> I have no idea how this works, but um, it's very exciting. The tables have turned. The opposing team is currently in the lead. Limit is not looking too good in this current match. Guy looks a little bit heavier than he does. I know they have to be in the same range, but he probably has a couple more pounds on him. This is it. And it would appear that Plymouth did not win. Is that true? Uh, yeah, they lost. Okay. So if they hadn't forfeited two matches, they probably would win. Ah. Why would they forfeit two? Uh, because they didn't have anybody to wrestle in those classes. Oh. So Matt's doing his newspaper Size thing. Size matters. Uh, but they tried. It wasn't that big of a gap. What it ultimately comes down to is the uh, state championship. So. They do have a few female wrestlers. Do the females wrestle with the guys? Yep. Do they ever actually let them wrestle? I've seen maybe one person win a match. I didn't know it was co ed. Very mildly cold. Obviously, there's a, there's kind of the awkwardness of the sport already. Then you put have boys fighting against girls. Hey, it's all more awkward. Hey, you know what? Some girls can beat the shit out of some boys. Oh yeah. <laughs> I know a few. <laughs> well, let me tell you about this girl I met in Toronto. Woohoo! Let me, let me put it this way. I'm not skinny, okay? I'm not fat, but I'm not skinny. This girl picked me up with one arm and throw me from him. I saw her level somebody. It was actually frightening. Oh, oh. Yay! Oh, they did win a little at the end. 
Good job, Plymouth. Good job, reporter husband. The guy who played Her Helen Solo does Harrison Ford impersonations for other things we're doing. Recording you. Okay. We're talking about the Lego movie. Did you have a good sort of Valentine's Day? I did. Yay! We both have to work on actual Valentine's Day, so. Yeah. <laughs> Such as adult life. Yeah. Ear. Look, his earlobe attaches to his neck. Yes, you're so... What? You're so thrilled with this. And mine doesn't... <laughs> Well, your type of earlobe is not common. You're special. special. You're special. Sorry. Happy Valentine's Day! Blah.